OK, so so far we've used JavaScript and jQuery to dynamically generate 24 different advent calendar windows. Dynamically generate means they're not written in HTML, they're made in code. So when the page loads, um, it will make 24 different boxes on here. OK, so remember there's three things we're looking at in, at in this project. The first is how it looks. So I'm looking for CSS that makes the project look pretty. The second is um, how efficient your code is. So whether you've got loads and loads of code uh, that does something or whether you're able to combine it into just a few lines that does something in a more intelligent way. And then thirdly, how well you comment your code. Um, so, so far I haven't shown you any comments in uh, JavaScript. In CSS, you can put a comment in with a forward slash and a star, and they are multi-line comments, as in they can go over more than one line. Uh, and you can put them at the end of a line if you want, um, or as a line on their own, um, like so. So that's a forward slash and a star to start them and then a star followed by a forward slash to end the comment. In HTML, you do um, a comment with an angular bracket, exclamation mark, and two minuses to start the comment, and then you finish with two minuses and then an end angular bracket. Uh, and they are also um, multi-line comments, as in they can stretch over more than one line. Oops. Um, in JavaScript, you've got a choice of comments. You can have single line comments, which are just two forward slashes, one after the other. And they're just single line comments, because the next line um, will be counted as code. Um, and you can put single line comments at the end of a line, and that just comments out the stuff after the two um, uh, forward slashes. Or you can have multi-line comments in exactly the same way as CSS. So that's a forward slash and a star and a star and a forward slash to finish off. Um, so the idea is, it's silly to add comments to every single line, because your code just looks cluttered. But every paragraph, or every time you've got some scope brackets, some curly brackets, it's a good idea to explain what's going on here. Um, so I'm going to say, generate 24 advent calendar boxes. <coughs> 